Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Solari Report. Solari's goal is to help people live a free and inspired life. And of course, health is a very important part of this. And to stay healthy, it's important to take care of your dental health. But if you go to a regular dentist, then you can run into issues because some of the treatments can be very toxic, uh, invasive, damaging. But sometimes you really, really need this. So what to do? So today we're going to introduce you to a revolutionary new treatment. It's called the ozone treatment, or it's been around for some time, but it's not very well known. It's non-invasive, non-toxic. And today I have a very special guest, Jacob Brandsma, who has been pioneering this treatment for the last 20 years here in the Netherlands. And we're going to discuss that today. Jacob, welcome. Okay, thank you for having me. Or can I call you well, Jacob? <laughs> sure. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, so to start, can you tell a little bit about yourself and why you got interested in this treatment, the ozone treatment? I was born in uh, the Netherlands, uh, Bolsward, a region called uh, Ugo Klooster. I've always been uh, quite interested in uh, dentistry, but the regular dentistry with uh, the drilling didn't uh, appeal to me. So in the 70s, I came in uh, contact with the uh, chiropractic. So uh, I decided to uh, become a chiropractor, went to... Uh, the California Bay Area, by the way, uh, mm -hmm. to start. However, I uh, did uh, the study in the, the UK, finishing in uh, 1984. And I've, I've always been on the lookout for uh, innovations. So uh, when I read a small article in the newspaper in the year uh, 2003, 9th of uh, February, I was immediately interested. So mm -hmm. I uh, delved uh, into it. And then you studied it because in 2003 the machines were not on the market yet. Uh, they uh, started to get into the. They uh, became the available in the market. Okay. So I, I was with a dental hygienist uh, mm -hmm. at that time. So uh, we started a discussion, mm -hmm. and he was expecting that uh, you know it would come out uh, soon, mm -hmm. but uh, nobody started it. Oh. And even after six months, uh, nobody uh, had started it, so I was getting a bit angry. Uh, because I wanted to get treated myself, I had a loose uh, tooth, mm. uh, the, the, the three seven. And uh, we had a discussion with uh, El Chiritzma, his name, <laughs> and uh, he was quite enthusiastic. So we set up a collaboration. He would do the treatments. Mm -hmm. And I would guarantee my uh, finances, you know, take out uh, the lease uh, titles and everything. So, and we started in Amsterdam in the beginning of uh, 2004. Mm 